Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. Don't panic, everyone. We're agents from the Department of Mitigating Criminal Activity. We receive word of a school shrunkening, and we're here to help. School shrunkening? What's she talking about? I don't know, Dan, but is shrunkening even a word? They heard you say, don't panic. No, students, these strange folks are right. There's not to be worried about. And certainly nothing sinister or evil afoot. Um, Dan? Uh, it seems like we're tiny too. Look out the window. Giant killer ants. Oh, M.G. Oh, it's you. Uh, yeah, it's me. I've been a student here for 12 years. Glad you could make it. Listen up. I'll fill you in on the situation. As you might have noticed, this entire school has been shrunk. The students are in a panic, and we need to set things right. We have agents all throughout the school, but they can only do so much. We need your help, Dan and Laura. Are you up for the job? With you on our side, we'll find out who shrunk the school and get things back to normal in no time. Laura, does that mean I have to do homework again? Yes, Dan. Well then, I'm not really sure I want it to get unshrunk. If you want an extra boost, our agents have some fun and helpful items for sale. Is this a sales pitch? Oh, okay, okay, we're, we're seriously, we're skipping this now. All right, Dan, we have to save the school. Where's Dan? 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 I'm coming, I'm coming. Let's get moving here. Whoa! This gave me super speed. Whoa! Whoa, watch out for that water. Don't slip. Boing. Boing. Whoa, all these students have gone mad. Holy guacamole! All right, I definitely need to get past that because I don't, if they run into me, they probably will kill me. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. So far, so good. Oh, no. Rotten banana for me. Whoa. All right, I need the speed boost. I got to jump over these guys. Oh, my gosh. There's a slippery banana on the floor, too. Okay, that makes me kind of laugh. Guys, I think you do this through, you do super speed through this whole game. I haven't played a game like this in a really long time. Oh, wah, 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 wah. Dan, are you even still in the same game? I'm still here, Laura. I'm just dying, like a lot. <laughs> I slipped on the floor. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, oh, the bananas are super slippery. Don't run into those, because, oh, gosh, you die every single time. Dan was in the game with me, but um, we got separated. It's okay. We'll meet back up. Right, Dan? If you could stop dying, maybe. Hey, you die too. Oh, wait. There's Dan. Uh, yeah. I, I have to confess. I have died a lot in this. This is... Oh, Laura. You slipped in the water. Uh-oh. Whoa. Oh, no. I almost didn't make it. What is that? It looks like killer worms or something. I don't know. I was going so fast I could barely see anything. Hey, look, it's the agents. Have we saved the place? Ah, oh, yes, even giant bugs, worms, and bowling balls can't get in the way of a good old-fashioned dodgeball. And neither can you, for the record. We need to get through here to find who shrunk the school. So try not to get hit by the dodgeballs, okay? Come on, how much harm could a dodgeball do? 
wow, that looked like it really hurt. Well, good luck. I can do this, no problem. It's just a few dodgeballs, right, Dan? Oh, uh, Laura, you stink at dodgeballs. You're right, oh my gosh, I ran off the edge. Oh, I was so busy worrying about the dodgeballs that I literally rolled off the edge. Oh, they hit me with a dodgeball. Oh, all right, listen here, you little Laura, come on, be nice. I was gonna say turds, but <laughs> I guess it's not nice to call the opposing team turds, so I'm not going to. All right, here we go, guys. Um, come on, Laura, you can do this. Sometimes Laura just needs a pep talk. See, you did it. Save before you die. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's more dodgeballs. Oh my goodness. Actually, I think you're getting better at dodgeball. No, I still fell off the edge. Well, at least you saved halfway through. That's good news. You died too, Dan. Yeah, this dodgeball in Roblox is much harder than real life. You know I always win dodgeball in real life. Oh my goodness. Oh no! I like when you die how it gives you a rotten banana. It's like, oh, you smell so bad. You stink. Boing. <laughs> All right. This time I'm gonna make it. If you guys believe in me, slam that like button. Come on, guys. I need you to believe in me. I I just, I, I could do it, right, guys? Oh my gosh, I did it! Hooray! All right, now I'm, I'm climbing up in the basketball hoop. All right, where do I go now? I'm confused. I gotta wait for Dan, because I don't know where I'm going. Dan, where are you? Giant ants. Okay, I don't think we can go down that way though. Can we? Oh, wait, I think maybe we're supposed to. Whoa! No, just kidding, we can't. Dan, did you have to do this part again? Oh, a dodgeball hit me guys, did you see that? And I didn't die. Whoa, Laura, you're like superhuman. A dodgeball hit you and you, oh, you died that time. Never mind. you're not superhuman. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't know why it hit me the first, it hit me the first time and I didn't die. But yeah, the second time, I definitely did. Guys, if you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, please hit subscribe. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers. That would mean so, so much to me, guys. Come on, I've been working at this for a really long time. If you like my channel, please hit that subscribe button. And you can see all of my and Dan's awesome videos. Including Laura dying a whole lot, like a noob. Whatever, Dan. See that ball? It hits me every single time, but I don't die. I'm super, super human! Till I get to that second part, and then it's like, oh man, I'm a goner. Oh, no, no, no! Oh. <laughs> I would have made it if I just kept running. This part is so hard. I already passed it, too. So it's just lame that I have to do this again. All right. This time, I want to survive. All right, now I don't know where to go, Dan. Where do I go from here? Oh, you got a super jump over there? All right, that was the easiest thing ever. And now for our regularly scheduled... Government mandated dance break! Do, 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 do. You're a part of it. Oh, MG, look at me, I'm dancing, guys. I'm dancing. I'm feeling that dance fever. Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. I guess we just have to jump on these blocks to do the dance moves. Whoa, why am I frozen? What's going on? Hey, wait a minute, why did it start me way back here? Because you're not a very good dancer. What? Yes, I am. I'm an awesome dancer. Um, uh, if you say so. Yay, I finally made it. Not yet, you've still got more dancing to go. Well, good thing, I'm an amazing dancer. Dan doesn't think I'm a good dancer. Maybe I should find a new boyfriend. Hey, no, that sounds like a terrible idea. Well, maybe my new boyfriend would think I was a good dancer. Whoa, looks like a huge food fight broke out. Forget food fight, this is an all out war. Um. Okay, now a bunch of kids are gonna try to throw 
food at us, Dan, and... That's making me starving. Oh, I could totally eat some food right about now. Ow, I got hit with a sandwich! Well, next time open your mouth so that when you go by, you can eat it instead of getting hit by it. Oh, very funny. These kids are brutal. Oh, I hit the save, so now I don't have to do that part again. It's kind of exciting. And then don't hit, um, like, step in any of this, like, goo on the ground. Oh, because it'll kill you for sure. I'm not sure what it is, if it's, like, drool or chocolate milk or what it is, but it looks gross. Stop hitting me with sandwiches! <laughs> OMG. Oh, my gosh, he almost hit me with that sandwich, but I jumped over it, so... I'm good. What is going on here? It's like... <laughs> They're burning lunch or something in the oven. Uh, Alright, I can't... Oh, you can't touch that? Like, I'm so confused. What, what do I have to do here? Do I have to go around it, maybe? Oh my goodness, I died again! Um, okay. Maybe I have to go through here. Oh, I see. Don't touch the oven, because it's hot. Duh! Whoa, these are really bouncy. Watch the burgers. They bounce. Whoa. Okay, I'm back to more ovens. <laughs> Wait, did I just come this way? I'm a little confused right now. All I know is this is making me really hungry. Oh, wow. Look at that, guys. There's a giant ant drinking the Coca-Cola out of there. Whoa. Dan, are you okay? Oh, not really. I'm sort of getting caught on fire. Okay, well... Since you think I'm a bad dancer, see you. <laughs> hey, wait for your boyfriend. Who said you weren't my boyfriend anymore? What? You said I was a bad dancer. I don't think I need to wait for you. Bye. Well, too bad because I'm leaving you behind. What? No, you're not. Yes, I am. <laughs> see ya. I just walked out the exit before you, so I win. No, you didn't. I was here before you. This is exactly why we can't be boyfriend-girlfriend anymore. What organization do agents cease and desist work for? Welcome to the quiz. Hope you've been paying attention because now it's going to be put to the test. By the end of this quiz, we should have enough information to figure out who shrunk the school. All right, let's get quizzical. Um, okay, well, it wasn't the YMCA, you know, like YMCA. That was just ridiculous. What does the DMCA do? Take down outlandish, sinister, yet excruciatingly unoriginal criminals. Conquer the faces of evil? No. No, you guys aren't that special. Sorry to bug you, but what? Okay, I didn't, I didn't catch what she said. What insect was outside the window in the classroom? A giant ant. What could have been used to shrink the school? A psychiatrist. No, a shrink ray. Where have we seen something that could be a shrink ray? On the desk in Professor Bot Bootleg's classroom? Who was standing nearest to the object we saw that could possibly be a shrink ray? The kid who keeps telling corny jokes. No! Yeah, it's definitely Professor Von Bootleg. Um, who have we seen acting suspiciously? The kids who hated the jokes or Professor Von Bootleg? Yay! Oh, you finally figured it out, Laura? Oh, whatever, Dan! Well, now that we've sorted out all the information... I think we know the culprit that shrunk the school. It can only be... Professor Von Bootleg! Wow, that was a bit dramatic. <laughs> That's right! Was I who shrunk your school? I suppose you didn't recognize me when I was disguised as a school teacher. Why did you do it? Why do you... What, what, what do you get out of shrinking the school? Well, he doesn't have to do homework. Not the point. I don't know. I saw it in a movie once. <laughs> You'll never get away with this. Just try and stop me, simpletons. Bye! <laughs> Come on, Laura. We can't let him get away. Oh, sure. You're going to leave it all up to me. I better get a delicious cookie or cupcake out of this.
Come on, Laura, we've got to stop Professor Von Bootleg Pants guy. Ah, they hit me with this airplane. I thought they were supposed to give me a ride. No, those kids are brats. Hey, I wasn't allowed to call them turds, but you can call them brats. Well, I'm just saying they are kind of bratty. Whoa. Okay, I'm gonna make this. No, 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 don't kill me. I just want to survive, please. Oh, wow. I have to start all the way back here. Lame-o. Whoa. Okay, I've got to be super fast because that's where the paper airplanes are going to be. Whoa! Oh my gosh, I fell in the water. Oh, this is much harder than it looks, people. Much harder than it looks. Don't worry. Oh, <laughs> Laura, are you ever going to make it to the next stage or should we just wait here forever, noob? Wow, he's gotten really rude. Must be these school students have worn off on him. Guys, I'm stuck down here on this other book. Ugh. Okay, I made it. I made it. Shouldn't there be a save here? I really think there should be. Oh, come on. Oh, yes, 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 guys. I didn't get taken out by that one. Okay, that was really good news. Woohoo! <laughs> What is this? They look like minions. Hmm, persistent, aren't you? Well then, let's see if you can get past my army of mechanical contraptions. Don't worry, their bite is much worse than their bark. <laughs> okay, buddy, you're starting to get on my nerves. All right, I can do this. Just a couple mechanical little... Whoa, he's chasing her. Oh, that is so rude. All right, these guys are pretty easy to take down, though. Well, where am I going next? Um, uh, 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 I guess over here. Ooh, I saved. Okay, whoa. Oh, my gosh. They're chasing those poor students. Rude. Uh-oh, 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 guys. Um, yeah, this isn't good. Uh-oh, uh-oh. No, I didn't make it. Okay, that's all right. That's all right. No, that one's chasing Dan. Oh, no, Dan. Just go on without me, Laura. I love you always. Oh, he's so dramatic. Um. Okay. Okay, I gotta go this way because I already went that way. So I don't want to go that way twice. Wait, what's that? Oh, it's so you can have your own airplane. Pfft. No, I thought you were going to give me a prize or something. Uh-oh. He's back. Got back my contraptions did you no matter you'll never get past <laughs> lasers impressed are you i saw these in an online game i played once years ago took me forever to get past them so i figure they should hold off a simpleton like you indefinitely goodbye <laughs> Is he serious? These are in like every Roblox game I've ever played. Pfft, he is really out of touch with reality. Whoa, whoa. My jump is kind of crazy though. I feel like I'm gonna like hit one of these um, laser boxes and that's gonna be the end of me. No, Laura, you got this. Seriously, I know I tease you about, okay, never mind. You are a total noob. What? What are you just about to say? I was just about to say, I tease you about being a noob, but you're not actually a noob. But then you went ahead and became a noob again. So I couldn't say you weren't a noob because you acted like a noob. Whatever! We're breaking up. Oh, she went into the bathroom to cry. Oh, why do girls do that? Because you're rude! <laughs> there you are. What kept you? Um, I was fighting with my boyfriend. Never mind, we can take a shortcut through the bathroom. Let's catch up with Von Bootleg. It's crawling with the robots, though. That, that's, not to mention the power's out. We've got some flashlights, but we're not permitted to give them out for free. What? You're gonna try to charge me for this? I don't think so. I'll just walk through here in the dark. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Suit yourself. They're just little robots. Oh, boy. <laughs> Dan! What? You were getting in my way. I needed to get out of the way. Ah! The robot chewed me and swallowed me! Ah! You annoying little robots. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yep. Definitely not good. They sort of like make you buy the flashlight in this part, Laura. Yeah. It's so lame. 
You can't, like, you can't see where you're going and then you slip in the water. All right, fine. You can have my 45 Robux. Ugh, I hate when they force you. Actually, guys, watch this. I bet this gift stage is less money than the actual flashlight. Let's see, does it let me? Let me skip the stage. I don't know if it lets me. I tried to click on it, it, it didn't want to let me, but all right, I guess I'll just buy your flashlight. Fine, I'll buy the flashlight. Laura, it's 45 Robux, quit being so cheap. All right, I got the flashlight, guys. I don't see where this helps. Okay, yeah, it does help me quite a bit. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. The flashlight is helpful. Oh wait, I'm gonna stand on this toilet. Oh God, here comes another one. There's robots everywhere, people. Ah! Laura, hurry, up here! O-M-G. More, seriously? Well, I guess this came in handy then. But at least I hit that save button before he got me. All right, let me bring out my flashlight again. Wouldn't it be great if they were afraid of, of like light or whatever? Oh, that one's flying, are you serious? This is a bit ridiculous, don't you think? Oh boy, I slipped on the toilet and I broke my skull. <laughs> Where do we need to go? Ah, no! Oh gosh, she's gonna eat me. Yep, totally. Wow, this game is so long. I can't figure out how to get out of this school and get it from being unshrunk, people. I mean, for reals. It's like a maze. I can't figure it out. I can't figure it out. Oh, I went the wrong way. Okay, I think I need to go the other way. So this is like all water. Okay. Oh, boy, this is stressing me out. These robots. Okay, I think if I go this way and then this way. and Oh, my God. No, no, no. Is this the right way? I don't know. I'm standing up on this toilet. I feel like I went in a giant circle. And then I slipped and then something's going to eat me and... Oh, Dan, I found you! Hey, Laura, what's up? You still wanna break up with me? Yeah, but thanks for helping me get out of here. Ah, oh, finally. Okay, can I turn my flashlight off now? I wouldn't count on it. There's still more. What? Oh my gosh, this part in the bathroom goes on forever. My flashlight seems to need new batteries because it's not working very good. Oh boy. Oh boy, peeps, oh boy. All right, I'm up on the sink, but where do I go now? I can't figure that out. Um, all right, I have to keep going this way, I think. Whoa! Oh, I'm back in the vents. Oh, thank goodness! Oh no, not him again! Behold, my greatest contraption! Ha 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 He's sure to knock you out cold. Quick, into the sewers! What? I'm not afraid of a giant refrigerator. I love giant refrigerators. Yeah, I bet you do, Dan. I bet you do. All right, I'm going to the sewers, which is just really gross. <laughs> it's like so gross. We're, okay, where am I gonna go now? Just gonna float down, I guess. I feel like a giant doo-doo right now. I'm just floating down. Uh, don't ask me why. Oh, you can't be in that water because you drowned. Apparently, I don't know how to swim in the sewers, guys. All right, where do I go now? All right, there, I went through like a sewer waterfall. That was gross. Oh, I see, oh, I see, okay. <laughs> that guy was like taking a bath. Um, You might want to take a bath in the sewer, just saying. It's probably a bad idea. What? Is that? It's like a giant hand to smash you. I did not see that coming. Oh, the giant refrigerator smashed me into oblivion. Oh boy. Oh boy. I didn't make it. Oh my gosh, guys. All right. I can do this. I know I can. I just got to keep moving like very quickly. Oh, never mind. I got flattened. I can barely see where I'm going because this thing just wants to like pfft, smash me. I think I have to just like wait here for a second. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Okay, he's just never gonna go down again. Seriously, come on. Uh, 
now he smushes me. Okay, I was waiting forever. I don't understand that. This part's like so hard, guys. I, I think I might need to skip a stage on this one. Oh, <laughs> then I just walked off the edge. Oopsie. We're good, we're good. We can do this, peeps. We can do this. Whoa. Oh, come on. Why do I keep falling off the edge? I think my computer might be broken right now. Yeah, I'm just gonna blame it on that. Okay, I know I'm on the edge, so I'm, I should be good. Why do I get, okay, guys, I don't know why I keep getting smushed there. I'm definitely gonna pick a skip the stage. It's 25 Robux, you betcha, you betcha. I, I gotta get out of the sewers, guys. I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> oh, I'm still in the sewer, but I'm not next to the smushy hands anymore, so that's good news. Sometimes, people, you just gotta skip a stage. It's just what we gotta do. Oh, what? These guys again? Not these killer robots. Yup, killer robots, Laura, killer robots. Don't you wish you had your boyfriend here to protect you? Whatever, I can protect myself. I'm super good at protecting myself, sort of. Well, we could work together as a team, see? Um, yeah, if I could stop walking off into the sewer water, sure, that would be great. Wow, we. Oh, even if they touch you, like, that one just hit me with its butt, seriously. It didn't even chop me. If you just touch them at all, you die. Which seems a bit ridiculous, doesn't it? It totally does! <sighs> Is Dan even still in here? Okay, yeah, there's his name. He's still playing the game. I thought maybe he gave up. Me? Give up? Never. Oh, MG! I, I just, I need to finish. I need to finish and unshrink the school. I've made it so far. <laughs> oh wait, I didn't get past him. Um, guys, um, don't judge, but I'm skipping this stage too. What? You're skipping half the game! No, just these two stages. They're super hard. And well, um, yeah, I don't want to be here all day. I need a cookie. Well, now you're up with me because you skipped the stage, not because you're not actually a noob. What? Whatever. Ah! I hate those little robot bug things. They are so annoying. I think that's the point, so they can get you. Yeah, they keep getting me. Oh, okay. This time I can do it. I know I can. Have you guys played this game before? Let me know in the comment section below what you thought of it. Did you like it? It's a really long game, which is kind of fun, actually. Whoa. What? Oh, I slipped in the water. I didn't even see that. Oh, man, bummer. Okay. Oh my goodness, yes. Okay, I made it. Where's the next one? I don't even see him. Oh wait, that's like that's like a one where they don't have any. Okay, I'm gonna wait here and then boop. Okay, no, don't let me sleep. Ah, no, no, no. Oh my gosh, I keep dying there. Okay. Laura, you can do this. I believe in you. Since my boyfriend's gone and I just need to believe in myself. All right, so the next one, we have to be careful because he goes right up into that space right there. So we've got to move really quickly. Quick, 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 ah! And save, hooray! Are these sewers normally this big? I don't know. Is this piece of bread? Someone's feeding the birds. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, they, they like, when you jump on them, they collapse. Oh no, not more fist punchy things. Everybody knows I stink at the fist punchy things. Boing, boing. <laughs> okay, that was funny. <laughs> oh, and then I got bopped by the fist puncher. No fair. I've got to start all the way back here with the, the sinking bread. This game is really fun, guys. Some parts of it are difficult, but if you haven't played it yet, I think you're gonna really, really like it. Come on, come on, fist puncher. Okay. What? No! I don't understand the fist puncher because like if you stand, you could stand here forever and it won't try to punch you and the minute that you go on it, it tries to punch you. So I don't understand. I don't get it. Boing, 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 boing. Oh, come on. Well, it's official. My girlfriend is a noob. I'm not a noob. I'm just... I don't know, I'm, I'm, 
I'm carb free right now. I don't like bread. <laughs> Maybe you have to go over this way around these guys right here. There's just too many of them though, so I don't think you can go that way. Ha ha ha, I made it that time. Thank goodness. No, why did I die at the end? Oh. Laura, seriously, just skip the stage. It's worth the 25 Robux. Okay, fine. These guys are taking all of my money in this game. It's okay though, I wanna show you guys every stage. So I don't wanna just get stuck on one stage. You know what I mean, guys? Wait, um, this way? This way, Laura, come on. Whoa, those pipes are slippery. This is not for a new um, Roblox player because this is harder than it looks, like a lot harder than it looks, guys. So if you're new to Roblox, you might want to hold off on this game. But if you've been playing for a while, you might really like this game. Whoa. I just figured this out though. You cannot make the jumps. You have to just like kind of walk down and then save. Actually, Dan, I've never been so glad to see you. Me too, Laura. Let's not fight anymore. Let's just go for ice cream. Yeah, as soon as we beat this bad guy, of course. Yeah, of course. Huh? How did we get big again? Never mind. There's the school. Oh, it's so cute, little bitty. <gasps> Wait a minute. It's... It's unshrunk, but 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 how? <laughs> Twas I who unshrunk the school. I kept watching that movie I got the shrink ray idea from, and guess what? They had a reverse switch on their shrink ray. So of course I took that too. <laughs> Uh-oh. I thought that meant he was a good guy. No! Oh my gosh, it means he made that that refrigerator monster huge too! <laughs> Wrecking a city with a giant contraption is much more favorable than terrorizing a shrunken school. I'll see you simpletons later, but when I'm scraping you off the bottom of my contraption's boot, because it's going to squish you. <laughs> like a bug. <laughs> oh, this problem just got a lot bigger. You're telling me. I have an idea for taking it down, though. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I think I am. All right, Laura, we have something we have to get from headquarters. You chase after the professor and try to get that shrink way I can't even talk. I'm so, I'm so flustered. We'll meet back up at the construction site over there. Don't let us down. Good luck out there. We know you can do this. Seriously? You think I can do this? Okay, if you say so. All right, okay, I already failed. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. There's screaming kids everywhere. Get out of the way! I've gotta get this shrink ray before he just makes this whole place destroyed. Whoa, whoa, okay. Whoa, oh my God, guys. Oh, I don't even know what I'm doing right now. I'm going so super fast. Oh, that's okay. It's all right. I gotta jump on this giant cheeseburger and then, whoa, not gonna hit. And then over here and then not drown in the water. That part is so hard. OMG. Whoa, whoa. Oh my God, I actually made it. That was pretty amazing. Okay. All right, I can do this, guys. I can do this, right? I think. All right, there's a save button. Thank goodness. I'm always so excited when I see a save button. I need them. I need the saves, all the saves. All right, we're gonna power this up, guys. Jump over these worms. And where are we going now? I don't know. I don't even know. Oh my gosh, I ran into a worm. Whoa! I think I'm supposed to go up these stairs. And then what? Another test. Which spectacularly splendid evil genius set up this extraordinarily wordy quiz in an effort to slow you down? Oh, 
Which of my delightfully devilish contraptions laid waste to the city? Leaving it in its current smoldering state. The refrigerator. Who's the confounded do-gooder who keeps getting in my way? Me! Oh, man, I died. I, I stepped in the lava. All right, let's try this again. Um, the doors are all open that I already opened, though, so that's good. Oh, man, I died again, guys. It's hard not to jump in the lava in these doors, for sure. Okay, I just got to take my time a little bit here, guys. All right, here we go. Whee! All right, yes, finally! Get, get over here! I'm tired of chasing you, you little brat! Whoa, oh my gosh, I fell in a banana, of all things. Okay. Well, now the doors are all open, but I just cannot step in the lava, guys. I think this might be the longest Roblox game I've ever played in my entire life. And sometimes it, oh my gosh, he's shooting the shrink ray at me. Hey, knock it off, naughty. Oh boy, <laughs> I drowned in the water that those huge sandwiches are in. Whoa, whoa, oh, you can't over jump or you definitely don't land on the sandwiches. I don't know where my boyfriend went. He's probably eating the sandwiches right now because I don't hear from him, but it's, it's cool, it's cool. I can make it all on my own, no problem, I think. Laura, do I have to rescue you again? Um, maybe? Oh, I keep dying in the same spot. Okay, this time I can do this, guys. I believe in myself. Oh, no. <laughs> no. No, I was totally taken down there. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Can't somebody else get this bad guy? Obviously, I'm too big of a noob right now to do this. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, guys, I made it farther than I've ever made it, and then I died. <laughs> <laughs> I've already skipped the stage so many times. I just feel like lame if I skip it this time. Please don't hit me with a peach ball. I'm trying my best here, people. Why aren't the students out to get me? Like, seriously, don't they want me to help them? Their school and everything's about to be destroyed. Their entire lives are going to be destroyed. And they're trying to hit me with a beach ball. This part is impossible of this game. Seriously. Seriously, I, I I don't even know what to do, guys. Oh, and then if I stand there and wait for the beach ball to go by, um, the sandwich sinks. So I'm kind of in trouble no matter what I do. If you guys can imagine that game Wipeout in real life, I would not be a good contestant for that. I would <laughs> die in the first round and I would lose all the money. So don't ever sign me up for that because I would not do good. Oh, come on. All right, guys, I'm skipping this stage. I don't care. I don't care what anybody says. Judge me if you will. The stage is so ridiculously hard. Who could ever win this? Who could ever win this? We will be here until we're 80 years old. It'll be um, one of those like birth to deaths and I'll still be playing this game, guys. I'll still be playing it, whoa. Oh, come on, I've caught him by now. I think I must have caught him, definitely. You haven't seen the last of our bootleg. <laughs> oh, I hope so. Look, he dropped the shrink ray. Oh, finally. Oh. You've got the shrink ray? Nice work, Laura. Check this out, the DMCA's most powerful invention. The DMCA Takedown. It's a special device that wipes all traces of an event ever happening. It's a bit complicated to explain, but if we put the shrink ray in there and flip the switch, everything will be put back to the way it was. It takes a lot of juice to get it going though. We need to plug it into an electrical outlet. We'll also need to clear a clear shot at a big and obvious target for the takedown to have any effect. The refrigerator should do this nicely. It won't be easy, but we can't make it. But if you can make your way up to that construction site, we can set up the takedown. Good luck, you can do it. Oh my gosh, you two are so lazy. You're making me do another mission? Are you serious right now? Hey, Laura, are you still doing this mission? Yes! How many more missions do we have to do? Seriously, this is just ridiculous. Oh, I already got cut by the sauce. <laughs> Dan, you just take over on this one. No, Laura, you're not going to quit. You're not a quitter. Come on. We can do this. It's just a few saw blades. You got it. 
Oh my gosh, I actually made it. Aren't you so proud of me? Yes, you're finally not a noob. Congratulations. What? There's more of those bot things up here. And the thing took me down. Okay, well, I'm sorry, but um, we still have to try to make this happen. I mean, what are we going to do? Let the city be destroyed by that huge inf infrigerator? I don't know. I don't care. Let him take over the world. Tell him to give me a cupcake while he's at it. Aura, that doesn't sound like you. You never quit. I know, but this game is so long and it's making me feel like a noob. <laughs> yeah, I could see why it would make you feel like a noob. Seriously. Laura, we made it. I don't know how, but I somehow did. And there's the infrigerator. Let's do this. Um, how will we get his attention? Well, if you keep it dying, that might work. Look, the plug! Oh, yeah, things are about to get real up in here. All right, we've got the takedown all set up. You want to do the honors? Just give that power switch a flip. Ah, oh, finally, the moment I've been waiting for. Wait, where's the power switch? Oh, uh, it's on the back of the device. Duh. L. Oopsie. See you later, infrigerator. No, not the DMCA takedown. All oh, my hard work just gone. Curse you, Laura. Curse you. Thanks to you, Von Bootleg was taken down and brought into custody. Couldn't have done it without you, Special Agent Laura. And you know what time it is now. Government mandated dance break. I thought you hated dance breaks. Eh, this is something worth celebrating. Now I can agree with that. Let's break it down. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's do this. And as a reward for a job well done, we've got a special top secret item to give you. Head to the back of the room and get that. Go to that big glowing pod to get it. Thanks again, special agent. Hi, uh, you're welcome. Most of the time I just felt like a noob, but I guess in the end, as long as I didn't quit, I made it happen. A charge coil? Whoa, that's so cool. It gets better and better the more you use it. Oh, wow. This is amazing. I love the charge coil and everything, but um, do you think I could trade it in for a cookie? I'm starving. What? No! But we can take you back to the past, unless you still have things you want to do here. No, let's go back in time and forget today ever happened. Around two o'clock every night in the biggest school in America, strange things happen in this school. A group of friends want to solve this mystery, but when they enter the school, they realize that the situation is much more dangerous, and they have to do their best to escape. Where am I? It looks like a really scary place, Daisy. I know. We need to find the manager's room. The manager's room. Okay. This shouldn't be too hard, right? Well, Daisy, come on. We better go find the manager room. Molly, I don't like this. They didn't even give us a flashlight. This is creepy. Yeah. What, what was that? Did you see that? See what, Molly? I didn't see anything. I'm too busy eating this Halloween candy. Daisy, stop thinking about candy. There's a monster in here. Molly, quit trying to freak me out. I'm not dizzy. I'm si I'm seeing things moving. Be careful. What's this, Molly? Um, it looks like more speed. Oh, we have to buy we have to buy it though. But if you need more speed in here, that probably means there's something scary in here. Daisy, Daisy, where'd you go? Oh my God, my sister just like ran off, and now I don't know where she is. Oh wait, there's Daisy. 
Daisy, that is you, right? Yeah, Molly. All right, can we just talk about how creepy the music is right now? Oh my goodness, it's so creepy. Oh, look, pumpkins. Daisy, I just heard something. It's okay, Molly. I think this might be the manager's room. Uh, it doesn't say. It just says blood room. Oh my gosh. I don't know what school this is, but it's creepy. It is creepy, Molly. I can't wait to get out of here. Well, let's try opening this door. Oh, Dizzy, it's locked. Hmm. That just says class B. Find the manager's room. Okay, this is going to take me a long time because, um, uh, where is this manager's room? Oh, look, a flashlight. Oh, 59 Robux, huh? 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 Okay, yeah, it's worth it, guys. It's worth it to have a flashlight because this is a very, very, very creepy game. Oh, finally, I can see where I'm going. They said this is a school, but I don't know. It looks more like a prison to me. What do you think, Daisy? I found something, Molly. What does it say? It's a, it's a note. He knows me. He knows my place. He knows who I am. He knows why I came. Okay. Um. That's kind of vague. All right, let's go. Let's go see if we can find another room. Molly, I still haven't found the manager's room. Hmm. Is this a door to exit? Because I really want to. There's no manager's room here. It's just this creepy school. We're going to find it, Molly. Don't freak out. I don't even know what halls I've been down yet. Just because I bet... Whoa. The lockers are all crazy. Molly, look. It's a teddy bear. Just a friend. No, I don't I don't need a friend. I need to get out of here. Oh, wait. There's a gym room. I've never seen that before. Or those jack-o'-lanterns. Oh, wait. Maybe I have because there's the speed shoes. <gasps> Daisy, there it is. The manager's room. That only took us 20 minutes. But, Molly, the door is locked. Okay, maybe I saw that before, but it was too dark for me to see it. No, this is the first time I think we found it. We have to find a room key. Let's start clicking on these lockers. Maybe it's in there. Okay, that locker is locked, so it's not in there. La, 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 la. Um, no. Where could it be? I don't think these lockers actually open. So I think what we have to do now is go into the classrooms or whatever and see if we can find the keys in there, guys. Any luck, Daisy? No, nothing, Molly. It's got to be here somewhere. I don't know, but this music keeps creeping me out. I'm following Daisy because I do not want to be separated from my sister right now. Okay, there's a flashlight. I thought maybe that was it. Look at, what about this blood room? Do you think it's in there? Oh boy, Molly, I don't know, but I found another... I found another note. Molly, you were right. It says this is not a school. I knew it. Daisy, I think I just found the key. Daisy, I found the key. Good job, Molly. Now, come on. Let's go see what this mystery is all about. Um, I just want to warn you, Daisy, that I may scream at the top of my lungs if something jumps out at me. I may scream too, Molly. Um, so, just so you know. All right, now I sort of have my bearings. I kind of feel like I know where I am. Okay, Molly, open the door. Um, I don't really want to, Daisy. Molly, it's the only way out. I know, but there's going to be something scary in there. I just know it. There's the class B key on the table. I need to find the class B and open the door. Someone's following us, Daisy. I just feel it. Well, there's nowhere to go, Molly, but out. We have to go through this now if we want to escape. 
just don't want to die. Please, don't let me die! I knew coming to the school at 2 a.m. was a horrible idea. It was your idea, Molly. Okay, well, um, I knew it was a horrible idea, but I did it anyway. Ay, ay, ay. Feels class B, Molly. Okay, I'm standing back. There has to be a gym key in here somewhere. Daisy, I found it! Well, they said it's not a school, but there's definitely some math doing, uh, math problems on the board that they were doing. Come on, Molly. Let's go find the gym and unlock it and see what kind of mysteries are in there. Oh, if we have to, Daisy, okay. Guys, I think this might be a good time to ask you to subscribe. Guys, we're almost to a million subscribers. Can you guys believe that? Come on, guys. Help our gaming channel to get to one million subscribers. Daisy, it's totally pitch black in there. I ain't going in there. Come on, Molly. Come on. I'm in a safe zone. The monster cannot attack me. I think there's a creature looking, lurking around here somewhere. What should we do? I vote run away from the school. Uh, 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 I vote run away. I vote run away too. This is too much for me. I'm getting too scared. Okay, well, we've got to find the exit door. And this is where lots of random things jump out and scare me! Haha, <laughs> Daisy, it looks like you're walking backwards just so I can't scare you. Oh god, I'm gonna die like a thousand times, I bet. It's gonna be okay, Molly. At least we're in it together. Sisters trying not to die. <laughs> yeah, trying. I don't even know where the safe zone was. Well, Molly, good thing you have me, and I'm pretty good at directions. You're pretty good at everything. You're ah! What is that? Is that supposed to be the scary thing? That's not very scary, Molly. Well, yeah, she isn't pretty scary. Hello! Do you want to be friends? <laughs> She's like a ghost or something. Was that seriously the scary thing? I don't know. Maybe her face changes into a monster or something. Maybe. She's still following us. Daisy, where'd you go? Don't disappear! Ah! I knew that was gonna scare me! Oh, I knew it was going to. Wait, it's gonna teleport me back. Okay, don't teleport me back. It's not even that scary, but it scared me because its face was like right next to me. Yeah, Molly, you totally wimped out on that one. Wait, where am I? I didn't respond next to my sister. Now, guys, I'm all alone. I don't... Oh, God, there she is again! Leave me alone, you demon! Bah! Oh, my God, Daisy, help! Molly, I don't know where you are. Just keep running. I think you're faster than she is. I doubt it. I didn't even eat my cupcakes this morning. Oh, God, where's the exit? Where's the exit? This place is such a maze. Oh, God, she's going to get me. Yep, I can tell already, because... Ah! <laughs> I told you guys I was literally going to scream this entire game. <sighs> okay. Okay, there's no respawn button. Oh, wait, that is the respawn button. Okay, got it. <sighs> I'm going to spend so many Robux here. Find the key and open the door. Wait, did it make me start at the beginning? I'm in a safe zone. The monster cannot attack me. Oh my gosh! Seriously? Ah! Why do you keep jumping out at me, you evil monster? Molly, um, I think you're stuck in the whole school forever. What? No! No! Daisy, please come back for me! Daisy! Molly, don't move! I found the exit, and I found the key to exit. Are you in the safe zone? Yeah, I'm I'm in the safe zone. Good. I'm coming for you, Molly. Don't worry. Your sister will take care of everything. Daisy! Oh, my 
my God, I'm so excited to see you. Come on, Maddie. Now stay with me and don't let that monster get you. I'm going to try, Daisy. I'm going to really try. You can do this, Maddie. I believe in you. Oh, my gosh, Daisy. I'm so... Oh, God, Daisy! Daisy, boy! Ah, she got me again, Daisy! She got me again! <laughs> She's just after you, Molly. I'm right here, Molly. Let's try this again. She just comes after me, Daisy. I don't know what to do. She's a monster! Yep, she totally is, Molly. Run, Molly, run! Which way, Daisy? Which way? This way, Molly! Oh, gosh. The hallway just seemed to get longer. Did anybody else notice that? That was weird. Guys, I can hear my heart beating in my chest right now. I think that means she's right behind me, guys. She's right behind me! Molly, you can do this! Stay focused! You've got this! Daisy, she's right behind me. We're at a dead end! Daisy! Jeepers, good thing we're just playing Roblox. Holy guacamole. You'd be totally dead in real life. Oh, yeah, I know. No kidding. God, she's creepy. She didn't seem creepy at first, but the fact she has zero face, that's really creepy. Okay, Daisy, I don't, I don't see her behind us. I've got the key, Molly. Let's go. I'm talking like really quiet just because I think she can hear us, but she's finding us without hearing us, Molly. That's, that's the thing. Where'd she go, Daisy? Where'd she go? I don't know. Take, take, take your time though, Molly. I think this might be the exit. Oh my God, Daisy! Did we just get out? Daisy, where are we? Daisy, it's dark. I can't see anything. Daisy! I need to find a key for open the door. Hope this is the exit door. I thought that was the exit door. What? It was a trap. It sort of was a trap, Molly. Don't worry, though. We're going to find the exit. I wonder if she can get us in here or not. The creepy music makes me feel like I need to hurry. Molly, I got a key! Okay, let's hope this one's the one that lets us actually out of here. What? I need to solve this puzzle to escape? Solve the puzzle and escape the school. What puzzle? This one, Molly. Oh, boy. Good thing I'm so smart, right, Molly? Yeah, exactly. Okay, this puzzle doesn't seem that hard, does it? Daisy, I think you did it! Um, what's happening right now? Well, Molly, I think this power is something, but I'm not really sure. Oh, yeah, the power box! Okay. Oh, another key. Are you serious right now? Okay, there's the door. There's the key. What's going to try to stand in our way, Daisy? That's the question. Always something, Molly, in this creepy school. Always something. Oh, we escaped! Good ending. Oh, boy. I'd hate to see the bad ending. Guys, thanks so much for watching me, like, basically poop my pants the entire game. <laughs> we love you guys. Please subscribe so that we can hit a million subscribers, and we'll see you next time. Bye, guys! <laughs>
Aw, that sounds great, Dan. So, what should we have for dinner? I don't know. How about some... Uh, meatloaf. Oh, I don't know. I was thinking pizza. Or cheeseburgers! Ooh, that sounds delicious. Or maybe we should have breakfast for dinner. I mean, we're grown-ups, so we can do whatever we want. We could have waffles! Ooh, that sounds delicious! I'll go get them started. <laughs> I love the way you think, Dan. Mm, these are delicious. Dan, you were supposed to wait for me, jeepers. Sorry, I'm starving. <laughs> Isn't our life so perfect, Laura? I wouldn't want our life to be any other way. Well, it is pretty great, I have to admit. <sighs> it's just, well, I feel a little, I don't know, lonely. Lonely? I'm sitting right here next to you. Yeah, I know. I don't I don't mean that I'm lonely like because you're here. I I I, I mean I'm lonely because I want a family. What? Uh, wait a minute. A, a, a baby unicorn? Actually, I was thinking there's so many kids down at the adoption center that need good homes. Maybe we could adopt one. Um, I don't know. We could think about it. I'm going to eat this waffle though right now. Dan, I'm being serious. Well, let's just do our night routine and relax and, like, talk about it tomorrow, okay? Okay, Dan. Oh, this is the life. Chilling in the hot tub. Oh, yeah. Dan, where'd you go? Are you going to help me clean up? Oh, uh, <laughs> oopsie, I'm already in the hot tub. Oh, Dan. <sighs> Good thing I don't mind doing the dishes because Dan hates doing the dishes. I hope when we have kids someday that they take after me and they don't mind doing them because there's going to be so many more dishes when they live here and so much more laundry. Laura, are you still thinking about a baby? Um, well, uh, yeah. I thought we agreed we're going to talk about it in the morning. Uh, yeah, okay. I could set up the um spare room with cribs. It would be so cute. I could make it I could make it like an adorable unicorn theme and and I would love that. Oh my gosh, she's still thinking about babies. She's even talking about it out loud. She's really serious about this. Oh, I don't know if I'm ready to be a dad. I don't know, I don't know. Dan, are you okay? It kind of sounds like you're hyperventilating. <laughs> Dan, did you just neigh? Well, I am a unicorn, you know. <laughs> it happens. Yeah, but you only neigh when you get really nervous. What are you so nervous about? I mean, being a dad. Uh, I don't know. I mean, we're really ordinary, except for the fact that we're unicorns. I don't think that that should matter. I mean, they can't just disqualify us to be parents just because we have a horn and a tail. And we're unicorns. I know we're unicorns, Dan. But we'd be amazing parents. We're going to be amazing parents. So what do you say? Tomorrow, should we go to the adoption center? I don't know. This sounds like a really big step in our lives. Yeah, but Dan, I think we're ready. Okay, I have to admit, I've been thinking about becoming a dad too. You have? For real? Yeah. Just, I don't know. I, I think, like, being a unicorn will... It, it's just different if you're a unicorn parent. No, it's not. Kids still, well, they cry and they want to be held and they want to drink bottles and they need to have their diapers changed. Whether you're a unicorn or whether you're not a unicorn or whether you're a unicorn parent or whether you're not a unicorn parent, it's pretty much all the same. Except for we have horns and a tail. Dan. Dan seriously, Dan, did you just like pass out? What's going on? Just the thought of being a dad is, like, so crazy to me. Ah, well, maybe he's just not ready yet. <sighs> no, 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 no. I think we're ready. Yay! You mean it? Absolutely. Tomorrow we'll go to the adoption center. Yes! <laughs> Dan? Dan, are you awake? Oh, I am now. Oh. Dan, it's it's adoption day! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Laura, it's it's 4.30 in the morning! I know, but today's the day that's gonna change our lives! Oh my gosh, Laura. 
I can't wake up this early. You better learn how, Dan. This is exactly the time kids wake up, start crying for a bottle. Wait, what? We have to get up this early? Are you serious? Oh, I can't even crawl out of bed right now. Oh, Dan. <laughs> you should be excited. We're going to be parents. I'm excited. Just give me some coffee. Nay. Oh, man. Oh, Dan, don't be nervous. Come on, this is going to be amazing. Okay. Uh, um. Don't worry, Dan. I'll do the talking. Hi. We're the unicorn family, and we'd like to fill out an application for adoption. What? A unicorn family? Are you serious right now? Uh, yeah, we're totally serious. We're unicorns. See our horn and our tail? Uh, <laughs> just my luck. Perfect. Oh, well, I'm glad you think that we're amazing applic applicants for um, adoption. Uh, yeah, no, I can't talk to you right now. Yeah, I know you're my boss, but I don't care, okay? I've, I've got something to do. Bye. Oh, wow. <laughs> Surprising you don't get fired. If I did that with my boss, I totally would. Dan, shh. We're trying to be nice to her, remember? We want to adopt. Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> that was totally okay that you were rude to your boss. <laughs> you're not going to get fired or anything. Yeah, sure. Not fired at all. Dan, shh. Sorry, I'm just a little nervous. Um, so, um, yeah, I'm gonna take my three wishes now. Wait, what? Yeah, my three wishes. <laughs> what do you mean three wishes? You're a unicorn, so I want some wishes. Oh, haha, <laughs> very funny. We're, we're here to adopt the unicorn family? We want to adopt? I don't care if you want to adopt. I want my wishes first. Uh, you've mistaken us for a genie. We don't grant wishes. Well, then I don't uh, grant adoptions. Um, actually, honey, if she wishes for it, we have magic. So she can actually have the wishes. What? Since when? I thought that was only genies in a bottle. Ugh, you don't even know about your own species. Pathetic. So let's talk about my wishes. Then could we talk about um the baby that we're coming here to adopt? Maybe, but let's talk about my wishes. My first wish is... To be the richest Roblox player ever! Okay, your wish is my command. What? Louis Vuitton? Amazing! And look at this huge bag of cash! Uh, yeah, but you're rich now, so, uh, you don't have to wear the jeans with the holes in them. Like, you can afford jeans that actually are all sewn together. What? No, this is totally in style. <laughs> this is exactly what I should be wearing. Well, I'm glad you're happy with your wish. Now, do you think that maybe we could um see the children that need adopting? Yeah, we want to adopt. Did we mention we're the unicorn family? Um, Dan, she knows you have a horn and a tail and she just made wishes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little nervous. Whatever. Okay, so for my second wish, I want to be famous. Um, you actually have to say I wish. Oh, I can't believe I'm even saying that. I wish that I was famous. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm so famous. Look at my microphone. P-I-G-G-Y. A piggy is after me. P-I-G-G-Y. A piggy won't just set me free. Oh, um, yeah, you're a super good singer and stuff. Yeah, best singer ever. And dancer. Don't forget I'm an amazing dancer. Um, good thing I made her famous because I don't think she'd get there off her singing and dancing skills. I know, right? She's terrible. What? What'd you say? Um, nothing. You <laughs> said you're amazing at being famous. Hello? Brookhaven Adoption Center, how can I help you? What? You want Karen's autograph? What? What are you talking about? <laughs> yes, I know I'm a kid, but I, I have to work here because Karen makes me do all the all the chores. <laughs> yeah, I answer the phone. <laughs> I don't know. I guess you can come in and get an autograph. Bye. Who is calling so many times? Hello, Brookhaven Adoption Center. How can I help you? <laughs> what? You want Karen's autograph? <laughs> oh, my gosh. What is going on? Why does everybody want her autograph? Karen, Karen, everybody wants your autograph. They're all calling the number. Karen, what, what what are you doing? I'm dancing, duh. I'm totally famous. Uh, um, okay. A P-I-G-G-Y. 
A P is after me. A P I G G Y. A P G won't you set me free? Wow, you sound like someone who does really bad karaoke. What? No, I don't. I'm famous and I'm rich. I'm the richest player in all of Roblox. Um. Okay. How? <laughs> because you weren't rich before. Um. That would be because of us. Whoa! Are, are, are you guys really unicorns for real? Yup. Yeah, we are. <laughs> Hi, I'm Laura. And I'm Dan. What's your name? Oh, I'm Molly. <laughs> nice to meet you. I think that's so cool. You guys are unicorns. Yeah, apparently Karen thinks it's cool too. Since she's been making me grant wishes for her for the last hour. Wait, what? Karen? I don't care what you have to say. You're just a kid and you're dumb. Go away. What? Uh, 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 fine. <laughs> Karen, I don't think that's the way you should be talking to the kids here. That's really rude. How do you still have a job? Be quiet, unicorn. I still have one last wish. Um, I don't think so. I'm not going to grant it. You have to. Oh my gosh. Please adopt me and my sister Daisy. She's mopping all the floors right now and cleaning the toilets upstairs. Karen makes us do all the jobs here. Oh my gosh, you're so sweet. Oh. Is your sister about the same age as you? Yeah, she's just a little bit younger than me. Ah, oh, we'd love to adopt sisters, wouldn't we? Well, you are pretty adorable, <laughs> and you seem pretty smart and nice, too. That's awesome. Yeah, so will you adopt us? No one is adopting anyone. You owe me my wish. Um, okay, but I don't know if this is such a good idea. I mean, you seem kind of, well, evil. I gotta get on my computer and print out an adoption paper. Then the unicorn parents can be my parents. Got it. Hey, guess what, Karen? <laughs> I have the adoption paper. They're gonna be our our parents. Daisy, we've got new parents. Get back here with that, you little brat. Nope, I don't think so. <laughs> you can't catch me, Karen. You're slow. You're slow. You're slow. You're slow. You're slow. You're slow, you're slow, you're slow, you're slow, you're slow. I wish you'd give me that paper. Uh, your wish is my command. Ha 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 Wait a minute. Did I just use my last wish? Oh my gosh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I take it back. Sorry, Karen. You can't take your wishes back. <laughs> what are you laughing about, you little brat? Seriously, what are you laughing about? <laughs> I'm laughing because Daisy printed another copy of the adoption papers. And now we're out of here, Karen. No! I can't believe it. You guys are actually going to be our parents. We can't believe it either. Molly, I can't believe that a unicorn is going to be our mom and our dad. Can we have wishes? <laughs> Only if it's Christmas, girls. I can't give wishes all the time. You guys will turn into spoiled brats. What? No, not us. We'd never be spoiled brats. <laughs> Speak for yourself, Molly. I want all the wishes. OMG! Don't be a Karen, Daisy. Don't do it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm nothing like evil Karen. Jeepers, I hope not, since we're all going to be living in the same house. Speaking of house, do you want to see where you live? Yeah, totally. Let's do this. Well, welcome home. Uh, go on in. See what it's like. Uh, gu guys, this, 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 this is a, this is a barn. Mmm, this hay is delicious. Anybody hungry? Dad, um, I don't understand. We're inside a barn. You're eating hay. Of course I am. <laughs> Unicorns are pretty much horses with giant horns on their head. Wait, you, you, you live in a barn? That's right. Isn't this amazing? Oh, well, at least we don't live with that crazy Kaylin anymore. <laughs> this hay will make a pretty good bed. Well, I guess we can check out what's up here. Uh, this, this could be a pretty good bedroom, I guess. Marty, the hay's not too bad. It's pretty comfortable. See, I'm sleeping on it. Um, we're, we're cool with living here. <laughs> What's so funny? I <laughs> just... Dan, you can stop eating hay now. I don't know. It's kind of good. Dan, we're unicorns. We don't eat hay. 
Oh, <laughs> yeah, I guess that will give me a little bit of a stomach ache. <laughs> okay, I don't know what's so funny. Can you guys tell us? Of course we don't live in a barn. We're just teasing you guys. Oh, really? You don't? Okay, that's a relief because I thought maybe because you're part horse, we really would live here. But we're not part horse, so can we live in a real house? Of course we have a real house. Don't be silly. Come on, we'll take you there now. This is our actual house. Whoa! Mom and Dad Unicorn, this is great! Was that a pool I just saw? <laughs> yeah, of course we have a pool. We have pretty much everything. OMG! A hot tub! Can I get in? Please, Mom, please, please! Sure, but do you want an ice cream first? Yeah! Um, can I just go in the kitchen and get it? Of course you can. This is your house now. But just remember, you can't have ice cream always. Sometimes you need to eat healthy. Don't worry, Mom. I will. Mm, this ice cream's so good. At the adoption center, we never got to have ice cream or anything delicious. Yeah, that's so true. Aw, well, you have a family with us now, and we're going to take very good care of you. That's right, girls. Hey! <laughs> Did you just neigh like a horse? He does that when he gets nervous. No need to be nervous. We're going to be the best daughters ever. Yeah, well, I will be. Sometimes Molly gets detention. Daisy, shh! You get detention, Molly? You seem so sweet and nice. Why do you get detention? Because she doesn't always do a homework. Daisy! Well, I think we're going to have to work on that, huh, Molly? Uh, we could try. <laughs> I'm kind of terrible at doing my homework. And then when I do it, I kind of forget it at home. Well, I can always just get it there in a split second because I'm a unicorn, so I'm magic. <laughs> I can snap my fingers and it'd be there in a second. Plus, I'm super fast, so I can just run to the school. Okay, Dad, calm down, calm down. First, I actually have to do my homework. Yes, and you will be doing your homework every night. Okay, but can we get in the hot tub? Sure, Molly, but don't forget to put your bathing suit on. Bathing suit? Who needs one of those? <laughs> yeah, who needs one of those? Ah, this is the life. Except for, well, uh, my ice cream is melting. <laughs> Mine too, Molly. Ooh, I love our new house. We are so happy that you're our daughters. Aw, we're happy too.